Farscape Engineers, Inspector Summary Video. We're here in Georgian Court University. And um, what we have here is a Farscape that's got some new rails. So these look like fairly new rails that got brought, be, that got brought in. Maybe this staircase also got brought in. This platform looks original. Original square head bolts, a lot of rot. So um, one of the things you need to do is to have an issue with securing uh, and getting some of these uh, things swapped out, so most likely this part, by the time you start playing around with this, this may need a new, uh, some new slats or a new piece of grating. Original square head bolts in the indication that there's no, never been any maintenance on this side. Even the, 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 the bar that holds it back into the wall, still tied to the original square head bolts. On the supports, original square head bolts. Again, anytime you're dealing, there's a connection right there. Anytime you're dealing with a fire escape, the main things that need to be swapped out in a 50 to 75 year life platforms and supports are critical connections, staircases and treads, critical connections, corner posts. So, uh, this fire escape's all welded. That fairly, that's fairly new section going down here, but up here, all these square head bolts that are part of the major platform need to be swapped out. Any material needs to be sistered and or replaced. Um, then any joints need to be sealed or ties back into the building needs to be verified if we can't then we need to put an epoxy connection on that side and epoxy connection on this other side because the only thing holding this thing back into the wall is those connections which may or may not be verifiable but epoxy bolt uh, can be made to the side to basically duplicate the connection um, lead issue um, this part up here is definitely older than 1978 so I would assume that that's this is going to require you to be a licensed contractor, workers' comp liability, and have a renovator's license to touch this part. I believe this other part you don't need to because it's uh, all brand new railings. And the supports, uh, a lot of them either they either have a rivet or a bolt. Any welded connections, I want a bolt. So this is an unverified weld connection, so I want a bolt in there. And that will basically guarantee that. That welded connection down there needs to be bolted also. As you can see, I can only see little nails and stuff there, so that's not a, that's any of that uh, properly reinforced. And up there, as you can see, you know the holes are missing. They just welded, so since that weld is no longer uh, verifiable, I need some bolts through there. And looking up there, you see all the original square head bolts. So those support bolts got to be reinforced or swapped out to new bolts on the support. So again, all treads must be dealt with and all supports. Brand new staircase, 100% welded. So. I would just make sure that you've got some place. Uh, I would put some weep holes in these um, so that way as snow and ice accumulate on these things they won't rot them out the way they are doing right now. And uh, then at the bottom I want the feet. Uh, once they're repaired, cleaned and secured I want the tar on the feet to make it so that nobody steps on the tar. Be very neat about it but uh, you need to tar the feet and I would tar four to six inches above grade so that the snow doesn't eat those. Same thing here. Once this is all done, put some tape down, tar it, and then uh, about uh, six inches above grade. So that way as the snow accumulates, it won't eat the bottom of these things. I don't have any tread problems because all of it is welded, so it's, it's all full welds. They all look pretty good. I don't have any issues, but the weep holes will help this thing drain. But as you can see, that uh, none of the, there's not, never been any work on these supports. I want them all rebolted, and uh, it looks like it's just minor tie-ins into that brace there where it ties back into the building so we need to make sure that that is pro properly lag bolted. Uh, any questions? Barscape Engineers, Inspector Manessis, 800-649-3333, 800-649-3333. Any and all bids to Mark at Georgian Court University.